Boy, it's really hard to believe that we have been down here in Tijuana for three weeks and we're going home tomorrow. We've been at the Hope for Cancer, for those of you that may not have been following us on our journey. So Mike, tell me just what has been the most impactful part about our stay for three weeks, getting you healed from stage four melanoma. Well, I got here obviously in pretty bad shape, which I was the frog in the hot water. I really didn't know how far down and dysfunctional my system, my organs had become. And I was in pretty bad shape, unbeknownst to both of us. So I'm walking out of here with a huge jump forward in my health, but I've got continued work to do. But I think the education is huge that came along with the treatments and therapies that were extremely helpful. So it's really a lot to try and fathom because it's been a, a very quick whirlwind and busy, busy, busy. So this place is just a godsend as far as I'm concerned. Yeah, yeah it truly, we truly do see how God has orchestrated this entire part of our lives in getting Mike here, bringing us the, the resources. The timing of it. Um, people, financial support, uh, the doctors, the therapies, the treatments really getting to the root of what's going on with Mike. Just, it's been a mind blower. So. Yeah, and the outpouring of all the, you know, our friends, uh, that for whatever reason, it just blows our mind. Yeah. Like 800 people look at something we've done, it's it's crazy. Yeah. But you can see God's hand working in all of this. Yeah. Not only for us, in the support and love that we got from it, but he's telling other stories that we're not aware of yet. Right, so we just want to thank you and we encourage you and invite you to come along on our journey. It's going to be a couple of years to get Mike completely back to where he was and uh, we hope that we can encourage you and inspire you in whatever may come your way. So we love you, thank you, and God bless you all. Thank you.